Randy McKee, Soccer 605 with uh, Senior Central Midfielder Eric Christensen for Dakota Wesleyan. Quite a game today against get Davenport here. It was. It was a very tough game with uh, the wind and the cold, trying to get used to a couple guys. are trying out some new positions today, and we just couldn't control the ball in the first half, and we came out very slow, but we really came out and picked it up in the second half. Looks like your coach probably must have given you a pretty good uh, visit at halftime because you guys really, uh, I mean, you immediately came out and took control of the game. Yeah, we, uh, we definitely addressed the issues that were uh, very apparent in the first half, and uh, we started to control the ball a lot more, and that really helped us dictate more of the game and come out and put one in. You know, you had to get some guys back there toward the end. They were coming at you with everything but the kitchen sink and the bus. Oh, yeah. They were really coming at us, and uh, we made sure to change up our formation have, and have to uh, two defensive center mids, so that helped us get the ball out a bit better. A lot of uh, GPAC coaches talking about you guys this year, and you feel like you're finally earning the respect you deserve? Uh, I feel like we are. It is kind of nice coming in as uh, the underdog every once in a while, but it is nice to get some respect and be able to show that we are one of those top teams now. Yeah, and you're doing it with uh, a lot of South Dakota players too, and that's one thing that we really like to see. Yeah, it is really nice having that kind of homegrown talent from around here so everybody kind of knows everybody and can really slid into the field a lot better. Well, Eric, uh, you know, you got a got a game against Rocky Mountain tomorrow and uh, got another long season coming up. We're sure looking forward to coming and watching you guys more in GPAC action the rest of the year. Thank you very much. Thanks for being with me. Yeah.